The door, I opened it. <laughs> Hello, come in. So we're just here to check out some of your stuff, some of your amazing collection. Yeah, a slight obsession, you know, a healthy obsession. You know. When did it start? Uh, uh, when 87, but since beginning of lockdown, I started collecting more and more. I know there's a big gap in between there, mm. but I was blown away by the film initially uh, when it first came out. I always liked the design for that box. Pinhead as a, as a character, of all the Senna bikes are good, but Pinhead especially, obviously you'll find out, you'll see it all. I just thought, what a great design and a character. And the book itself, the book itself, the, the Hellbound Heart, which is my favourite book. During lockdown, uh, it kind of got, it escalated. And it's still growing, there's still things in my wish list and it's getting bigger and bigger. This one here, it was a, a box that I've reclaimed and I'm going to upscale, so I've redone this box. You've got some of the brass bits from the box, the lament box, which I've put on the here. I have that engraved with the hellbound heart because in here, eventually, will be the book, this side of it, and in this side here, will be this, which is all, almost com pretty much complete now, will be going in here and it will be backlit. Mm. and this will be the box for the Hellbound Heart book and also I have these which are going to go on to the outside of the box one on each side uh, but yeah the outside 90% uh, complete the inside 70% complete but I'm really happy the way it's turning out at the moment need some fine tuning but as a box itself it's going to lend itself really really well to the book and the the films the franchise and with my collectibles and considering you know from the start i wouldn't have paid a lot of money to have this all put together and i like to think it'd be might be worth a bit holding the key to his cage the pill to swallow that and i'll swallow your soul like a manuscript choking twofold whoa this one's from COVID Creations, which I bought a couple of years ago. Can you repeat that? COVID Creations? Co <laughs> During COVID, I got onto COVID Creations. It's yeah. a, I think it's from Birmingham, this guy here that does these. And uh, this one has been up on the wall for a long time now. Time to play your son to go. This one here will scare you how much you'd want to pay for a brand new one of them online. I mean, dare I say, you could be looking uh, around about a thousand pound for something like this. I mean, I got a really good deal at 700 pound for that one, which is pretty good. The Pillar of Souls. Love this, this one here, there's a few different versions of it. This is the best one that I've seen. Uh, so I bought this one. A guy that made this, I have this certificate somewhere, and his name escapes me, had a, had a hand in uh, the film. And really? the costumes and the set. And That's the third film, yeah? Yeah, yeah. It's from the Hell on Earth. Hell on Earth. The light shade will come from America and it was laser cut. I can't remember what the wood is now, but it has been painted to whatever colour that is. <laughs> but it was it said I can't remember what it said on the the, 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 the bottle, but it was 
an, an armor base for Warhammer. What's up with the Winnie the Pooh? Yeah, well, this is this is out way before they even thought there was going to be a horror oh, yeah. Winnie the Pooh, a Blood and Honey. But I mean, this comes away in a few different parts. Another little box there, hmm. and this had no significance. It's just uh, a novelty uh, Hellraiser one, similar to me having a Hellraiser Homer. It's a waste of good suffering. Grogu. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and this one here, which I got begrudgingly because I don't like him. He's a bit muscly, isn't he? He is, he does. He's a bit action figure. You know, he is very much action figure. But their whole range of uh, ones are very much like that's their style, so okay. You got a new edition, is this the new edition then? He's the new edition, the mini Funko Pop. Yeah, trust me, you know, you're blessed. I've got so many sizes. They also have like a Minecraft uh, Hell Royce one. Keeps like their Minecraft. And also the Bad News Bears, which I have here. Bad News Bears. Yeah, that one, which I painted up to make it look fit the part, really. Yeah. But his name's Spike, that one. <laughs> and then we've got Homer in the background, which I think he's, he's quite cool, Homer. He's, he glows up in the dark. Him. But, really? Yeah, but you'd have to be really pitch black for him to notice a subtle glow. And then we have a Lego one there. And we've got a grinding one, who's bobblehead. Oh yeah, there's a, <laughs> a couple of wibbly wobblies. <laughs> There's a voodoo one at the back there, which him there. Oh, yeah. He's a voodoo. A voodoo. That comes as a set of three. I gave the other two away because I only wanted Pinhead. And the one at the back, the tall guy at the back, Pinhead. He has got has voice act. It, it's a uh, motion centers. So I got it turned off at the moment, but he says things from the film. <laughs> Just a, a multitude of boxes that you have. Just, just m money in there, little tin. <laughs> oh, I have Fur furry dice. <laughs> that look great. About the car, that's like. Go in there. And there's various ones in this one here, which I'll get down and open up because there's vinyl in that. The clock we have there, which now the ticking doesn't wind me up at night because I don't usually like any. Is that the time in hell? <laughs> yeah, we're always in hell in this room. We're always in hell in this room. We have the tiny little ones in here. I think that's the smallest one I have. That's mini hell. <laughs> and then this. Yeah. It's just an empty box and I got given that for nothing because it, it been the stickers had gone on wrong. Spiders living in knees. Hey. Hmm. Hey Frank. Oh, nice. Jesus wept. Jesus wept. Frank on a good day. Oh, yes. Still got some skin on him. Let's have a little look. So you got that one? Is that the one you got? With the character. Oh Is yes, it? yeah, I have one of them. No, no, I've got um, um Angel League. Angel League, no. is it? Oh yeah, <coughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Julia, she got what she deserved. Spencer, Captain Elliot Spencer, Doug Bradley himself. 
Master of Horror, one, two, three. Check Laser this. disc in the corner. I'm going to get this, these eventually, the trilogy at least, not all ten, but the trilogy, even though I haven't got a laser disc player. I was player. going to say, have you a laser disc player? <laughs> no, but I mean, it, it, in a it's frame. so cool though. In a frame, that would be quite good. Laser dust. The format that should have been. Yeah. So. And it would have been nice, I don't know how they, they can print anything on these these days, but if it was good, or in those days, because now you can have it printed on and still play just as well. Yeah. But it would have been nice to maybe have some uh, details on there. Yeah. But I, I, the reason I started off with this one, number three, is because at the time when this was on eBay, it was a price I couldn't let go at the time. I yeah. got it for six seven pound really yeah That's it really was well good. under a tenner i think it cost a tenner with uh, really post good. and packaging but if you go on look on my, uh, ebay for lasers generally there's thousands yeah. of them there's a lot of films that come out yeah. and i even had looked into should i just get for a laser disc just for the old thing you mm. can pick up a cheap one mm. but there's also they still do high-end ones that cost you a lot of money it's a waste of good suffering is this one which is I haven't read it the Scarlet Gospel okay which is hasn't is not supposed to be good but the reviews aren't good for it anyway okay so there's any reason I will read it eventually he, he had a little bit of an absence before he came yeah back and done that, I mean I will read it and get get me own uh, views on it and but for now it's just down there because I had to get it a part of the collection but they're also the Hellbound Hearts, plural, mm. which is a lot later, which yeah. is 21, 21, me neither, and I want to get that because 21 short stories, it'll be good read, it'll be a good read, and it'll be a good toilet read as well, so if you're reading it, you shit yourself. You're in the right place. The men you dare we continue from the back of your head and feet, this will open your crucifixion, that's the whole. Look down here, you can see some of the ones that I've had a hand in building, I have... Hellraiser parts <laughs> in here, including this little fella here, which I've had for months now and haven't got round to finishing them off, which is in here, which will get made at some point. I got one project, my main project, which I'm doing, and then I'll start on him. So, I mean, I have various pins, nails of, you know, goldy looking ones to the other ones. These are the, these are the paints that I've been using. That's the colour of the, the light shade, but obviously when you put it onto wood, porous wood, it kind of soaks in, it loses a bit. Yeah, so you made this, this one here, didn't you, with a, you went with a gold. Yeah, which I think, it looks all right. I mean, I'm going to get it again and do him true to the film, because I think he looks a bit superhero-ish. Yeah, he with, looks very grand. Yeah, his, his head comes off. Oh no, is it his head? No, I glued his head on. I thought I, his head did come off. Mm. But I like I like the, st the stand that he's on, with the the boxes, the lament configuration around the side. I think you're a killer, but I'm for real. Crimson moon, blood sickle field, spattering claret blood spill, blood to spill, crooked tooth. That's the deal. You thought it would be evil ash, but here's the steam. But there's a Japanese model also over here. If I draw your eyes to this little one, which I like. I paid too much for this for what it is. I would have liked this to be maybe twice the size and it might have been worth the money. But it's still really good. And she's lovely. She's got lots of curves and paste. That typical Japanese anime style. Exactly. And she's a peach. I have a little cheeky little, <laughs> cheeky little look up there. I mean... Cheeky. Yeah. And on the other side of the box, you can see what looks like, you know, flesh, torn, yeah, tortured flesh, one. burnt flesh, so. Yeah, that's really cool. I like I like, I like, I like, I like, I like, I like. This was from one of the earlier third, you know, what was the, the third film, I think. It was like the Pillar of Souls, the change thing. Is it actually Lego? Is it not actually that's, Lego, is no, it? No, that came with the, the one that looks a bit like Minecraft that's up there. Ah, so I'll just, just keep them separate. 
Do they all want to play with each other? No, of course not. Awesome. This is your realm. Yeah. I have all ten films here in various forms. Where? There is an awesome box set. And various bits in here. I have now down to 11 of these after, after about 20 of them. That was a DVD. So, so yeah, it's, a, it's a nice little box set, but you can, you can pick them up quite cheap. But if you buy them in bulk, you can pick them up really cheap. So it worked out. What I have left now hasn't cost me anything after yeah. making a little bit of money. inspires you and gets you so involved in the whole Hellraiser franchise? Like I said, the, 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 the story initially from the film, because obviously I knew about the film before the book, yeah. uh, is... The, it, it, I love the film straight away. The character himself, Pinhead, as well as the Cenobites, I think were really, really, really good. Uh, this design, I think even if I wasn't into the, the, the film, that design on the box is intriguing. It is. It is intriguing. Mm. And I think it's a nice design to have as like obviously a bed sheet, as a light shade that's really good. And I think despite the film, I think that's a good design. But I think there is a there is a good design. There's obviously there's ten films, they're not all great and there is a couple of real disasters car crashes of films in there. Well they started making them that they weren't even Hellraiser films originally and they just started putting yeah. pin it in there to make yeah. it Hellraiser. Thanks for showing us Glenn. Mate, no worries, and phenomenal. it's evolving ever, ever since. It's always evolving, and there'll be more, you know, more to come. More to come at no some doubt. point. More to come. Hit that thumb. Don't put a nail for it. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be back. We'll put the nail for it if that's your way. If you're that way inclined. Things are better with nails from them. <laughs> Hey, you came. You opened this video. <laughs> you breast. We came. Don't cry now. Such a waste of good suffering. suffering. Yeah. <laughs> Cheers, buddy. Well, yeah. You wanna join my clique? Get ready for this shit.